Please help. Hello and welcome to my channel. I am Samantha with Jolie Flips Vintage. Today I am going to take you to American Thrift in Hollywood. It's not a thrift store that I frequent because it's about an hour away from me, but it's been a long time since I've been there, so I'm sure that they are loaded with goodies. At least I'm hoping. So I'm gonna take you along with me, let's go. Something you guys need to know about this store. The parking's good for the most part, I think. But this area, the traffic is, is just really bad. Once you're in here though, it's totally, totally worth it. And the music's really loud here, but I'm gonna try to just talk over. I was just coming over here by the shoes um, close to the entrance and the shopping carts because sometimes, like two times I found a longer burger one by one next to each other, but I don't see any here that look like it. Let's go to the hard goods. Oh wait, this might actually be Maybe, let's see. Let's look underneath. Now that fooled me a little bit. What's in it? Batman, okay. Okay, so right when you walk in all the way to the left, there's electronics, like televisions, lamps. I always like to see if there's any good lamps up here. Some good mid-century modern ones. Yes. Nothing today. I'm kind of rushing a bit because they're gonna close in about an hour and um i just it just took a little longer than it should have to get here because of traffic the rain there's a hurricane coming on the east on the west coast and it is affecting the east quite a bit this is nice pot 5.99 i really want to hold pots this is a george briard design which is kind of neat I, I don't think i've ever seen a george briard pot before always looking out from for some Le Creuset. Oh, he is faceless. No, Le Creuset. Purple and white. Look at that, that's Dansk. Ooh. Akashi Copper Tableware. Kind of mid-century modern. I don't know how old that is. I don't like it though. It looks really worn. Let's see who makes the seahorse. Oh, Mary Posa. I love it. Look at that. It's, it's ten dollars, but you know it might be worth more. So we'll just put it there. I'm going to put my purse in here and then just. Definitely keep an eye on it here, you guys, believe me. Keep an eye on your purse all the time, but here, you have to. This guy was reaching for my purse one time here, and I was like, go ahead, grab it. Go ahead, grab it, because you won't have any fingers once I'm done with you. And he got scared, and he just took off. I mean, of course, I would not have hurt him, but, you know. Oh, you know what? These are very convenient. I don't think they're for sale. Oh, no. Maybe. See, because um, well, I kind of needed something to, you know, kind of show my rings. But I can use my own fingers. <laughs> All right, here's the housewares. They do have a generous selection. Um, there's some stuff on the shelves, just like the other American thrifts that I take you guys at. But we're, oh, look at this George Briard thing again. They're so worn though that I don't even want to pick. I will not pick that up. This black glass. Let's see. Um, um, that is not. Oh yeah, it's amethyst glass. Who makes it? Not sure, but she's talking a lot. It's only ninety nine cents, and it's not chipped or anything. And I could definitely. Oh, it's badly chipped right there. I could definitely see through it. It's very, very dense, so that is amethyst glass, but it's chipped underneath. And I don't want to sell that even if it's chipped underneath. My buyers in particular do not like 
you know, they just don't like chip stuff. They ask me all the time, like, is that chipped? Is it chipped? And so I understand. I don't want anything chipped. To say, is it worn? How, how worn is it? <laughs> I mean, I get it. I'm the same, so. Oh, is that Lucite? Wow. I wonder how old that is. It's pretty old. But it's like, uh, I don't like it. It might be Lucite. I don't know. That's longer burger. But I have a lot of those jars. What are these cylinders? Wait. This is Lucite. These are Lucite. I don't know what they are, guys. Let's just put it in here. They're just like decorative cylinders. <laughs> Okay. Oh my god, I love these bowls so much. Six ninety nine. Hmm. Their prices are a little crazy. Oh, I remember that though. About it here. That's another thing I should tell you. Yeah, the prices are a tad bit elevated. But, oh, I thought this was um one of those Christmas. Oh, it's something cool though. It's like. I don't know who makes that. It's super heavy. Hmm. Lots of plates down there. If I had more time, I'd look through the plates. I think this is for tea, right? <laughs> well, this bowl is really nice. Oh, oh, that's a really pretty bowl. It is super heavy though, but that's because there's wow, all sorts of chalkware in there. It's twenty-four dollars for the whole thing. I just want the, the, the bowl. That would look great on Cherish. Look at these. These are like chalkware fruits. They're like pretty banged up. I'm sure they're worth something though. But I will skip it. Let's see what else. Oh, look at this bowl. Oh, there's so much dust on it. It's marigold. Hold on. I don't think it's new because it's not a newer one because it's like worn all on the side but I like marigold I don't know other people do I have a lot of it it's cool though I hope somebody picks this up these are really nice blue flowers okay let's look at this pottery here with a very small entrance Mikasa Diane love oh I like that bear behind this bear look at him he's so different $12.99. It's huge. I'm trying to stay away from bigger pieces. Attico. Okay. So I know this pottery, I think. It's not broken. It's not signed. It's really nice. I like this basket. It's not signed. I would have signed that if I made that. Artistic. See if this is a mass produced piece under here. Yeah. Tabby Larsa. Oh, that's cute for bagels. Okay, there's something. Gotta keep an eye on my purse. Look at this teapot. Nice and simple. The cellar. Not a very valuable brand. Oh. oh my god, there's so much dust, you guys. I don't do well with dust at all. These days I've been coughing up a storm. Cool, it's got like flash in there. See that? It's like hand painted. I wish I knew who the designer was of that. Hmm. Let's see. Let's see, make sure I'm not missing anything. I'm sure I am because I'm kind of rushing. He's Wedgwood. Wedgwood Moonstone. Hmm. I don't know if he's worth anything. Is he like a vase? It's not expensive. $7.99. Look at this mirror. It says Queen. Hey guys. I am one. Just kidding. Well, yeah. I'm a, I'm a boss. It says it on my keychain. I call myself a boss. This is pretty. Oh. This would be nice if there was like a whole set of it. Oh, look at this. Milk glass tray. Oh, it's so vintage. Oh, 
Don't tell me it's chip. Why? Totally chip. That was really vintage and pretty. I'm like, why? Don't be chippied. An ugly gnome. <laughs> this is cool. Sitting bowl. Hmm. Not much about it. I have one of these swans. And it won't sell, so I won't pick that up until mine sells. It's been sitting there for like six months. <coughs> it's a long time. Let's see. Some stuff back here. Oh, wait. Uh, handmade Czech Republic swinging golf club. Alrighty. There's some cool plates back here. Wow, what are these? So, made somewhere. I don't know. Really nice. I love I, I love irregular stuff. You know that it's not like perfect. Like a glass peach. Mortar and pestle over here. Just a plain one. Some candle holders back here. Some candlesticks. And this little pot. All right. The pewter dish is three dollars. It has a sun on it. I kind of like it. So I'm just muting the parts that are when I'm quiet because you know the, I don't want to get a uh, copyright strike. So, uh, pewter doesn't sell for me. That's really cool, isn't it? Is this Camilo? Yeah. Camilo in Poland. I've got a bull right now that's listed for over a thousand dollars. If you ever find a Camilo bull, don't you dare let that thing go. <sighs> uh oh. I heard vomir, which means vomiting in French. Because I speak French. Oh, these kids are going crazy over here. They're so excited. This might be dance. Yeah. Dance Bistro. Isn't that so beautiful? Some pieces are very valuable, though. These are cool. These are salt and pepper sellers. Wow. Oh, look at this one. This is a very unique vintage one. Right? We've never... I haven't seen... Oh, my gosh. I don't... I'm sorry. Sorry, guys. I don't know why... I haven't seen one like this. I like it. So I'm going to get that. I've never actually seen one in that shape. No, I do see them, but not in that shape. This is cool. Made in China. Okay. I mean, they're kind of helping drown out the music, so I don't entirely mind it. Oh wow! Look at this. Nasos Rodos. That's cool. There's like some kind of fight going on around here. Hmm. Unfortunately, there's no price on it. And here at American Thrift, they do not sell things without prices. So, I'm just going to leave that. I don't really like it anyway. This is, um, oops. What do you call that? Again, I forget the name of it. When there's, um, sprayed color. <sighs> not getting too, too lucky. Is that really 99 cents? Oh, probably because it's like broken like here and broken here. There might have been something that went over it or something because it's really, really rough. Oh, look at this box. Oh, that's so vintage. $12.99. Avon made. Oh, Sarah Marte. You guys, I don't know much about um, Avon and which ones are valuable or not. I really stay away from Avon. I mean, I truly do. The nice little smoky brown glasses. Ooh, fiesta wear. Let's just take this because I don't know if the spoon rests are valuable. Sometimes they are. That's a perfect spoon rest. Oh, look at this. It's like a turtle box. Uh, not for $10, though. Cool, though. Now we're talking a little bit, right? Sam's a little bit happy now. Dumbo. Maybe he's worth something, but 
trying to stick with like luxury goods. It's kind of cool. Oh, it's all broken. Royal Dalton, England. It's the plaque. All broken in there. Let's see. What is this? Capital something. This is nice. I know that this kind of style is getting popular now, these vases. It just kind of reminds me of like that Napoleon, Napolitan ice cream, I mean. The strawberry, chocolate, and vanilla. And if you were to swirl it all together, like this is what you would get. For $7.99, I quite like this pottery dish. It feels heavy and healthy. I like it. Somebody might like that. Likely on Cherish. I saw those kind of things there. Oh, these Mickey head trivets. Ooh, Disney Thailand. For 99 I'm gonna plain. Just take it so I can, you know, find out the value of it. This little cat and the pumpkin's cute. I see something back there that looks interesting. Might be soap. Oh, might be soapstone. Yeah. It is, but it's still cool, isn't it? Let's put it here so someone can actually see it and buy it. Um, that was loose light or something. Oh, it's a cute chicken. Oh, look at this carnival glass. Um, ah, well, I wish he was actually old, but he wasn't. But he isn't. Wouldn't that be really cool? It's like all worn and chipping. Um, so bad. It's all broken inside, I think. Wait, no. Oh, it's San Francisco. Crystal. Well, look at this kid. Oh, really freaking out. Oh, gosh. I don't have taper. Hold on. It's just like, I'm just like shocked that people would let their kids scream like that. I know I complain about it like every video. It's like, why do I even come here, right? If I can't stand it, but I can't stand it. I love children. I just don't have any because I, I, I would not be able to tolerate that yelling, you guys. Please don't judge me. It's just true. I, I can't do it. And people will say, well, it's different when they're your own. Well, that may be true. It doesn't mean I want to do that, though. <laughs> it does not mean I want to do that. I want to be able to go to the thrift store and provide you guys with some cool videos all the time. And without worrying about, is my kid going to tear up the store? <laughs> Is going to tear up the store or what? Is this true Tanala? Well, it says Costa Rica. It's showing. Yeah, it's nice. Not special, special. A lot of uh, florist pieces. Oh, he's cool. <laughs> what is he, like a composer or something? Um, I see some brass. Oh, that's interesting. <laughs> Missing rhinestone in his eyeballs. This is really pretty. Some, someone made that. Probably looks prettier than it actually is, though. Oh, look at this. Is it glazed inside? Yeah, so therefore you can use it. I don't know what it's supposed to be. <laughs> oh, oh, it's broken. Made in Italy. Wouldn't that have been real nice if it wasn't broken? Is it really broken or is it just the style? Yeah, it's broken and then they glued it. That's just really cool though. Um, oh, so MCM. I'm not selling unicorns though. I, they're not selling. Are you guys selling it? Are you guys selling it? Let me know if uh, you're doing well with unicorns. So I sure ain't. A lot of things I wouldn't buy for myself, you know, out here. So I never thrift things that I wouldn't want to own myself. That is the for sure. For sure, for sure. None of these things qualify for Samantha's home. No. This is a cool vintage hat hang but it's torn here that's just, just kind of cool it's 
$7.99. Hmm. I don't need any more baskets. This one's made in Portugal, though. That's cool. What about this inlay box made in control? Uh, control. Made in Korea. <clears throat> Is that a menorah? Hmm. It's cool. Made in China. That's yours? I don't know if this is like truly old. Mm. I'm not very good at those like clocks and stuff, but it looks very Art Nouveau and I like that style, but I will pass on that. This is nice. Let's see. I like that drip glaze. Love the blue. This is Fiesta. No. I always pick up Fiesta Wear vases, though. They do sell. Wow, oh, this is interesting. Okay. That, like a Thomas Kincaid box. Sure is. This might be Fenton Silvercrest in really good condition. Please be. Francis Burton Fenton. I mean, it's $9, but I like never find them. So I'm gonna get it just because it's pretty. It's really nice. Maybe it's discounted. No, probably not. Hmm. Silver plated. Hmm. I like to look underneath everything that looks silver. Cause you never know when they're actually silver. Like, what is this? <laughs> Wow, what is that, guys? Do you know? Clip it on somewhere. Oh. Oops. Oh, wait, I think it's a lighter. It's like an old lighter. Let's take it. We gotta look that up. Just curious about that. Uh oh, the kids are on this side now. That's cool. And a little dog. Aldon. And accidentally. Hit that there. Here's another silver crest. Let's take that too for six ninety nine. Yeah, I love it. I have a lot of ruffle vases now. This is kind of cool. Wow, that is very heavy. I don't know how old that is. It's cool though. Oriental stuff. Oh, look at this dragonware. Niagara Falls dragon wear nonetheless that's cracked. I would have picked that up just because I like Niagara Falls. Sometimes these things are all silver. So make sure you check them. Uh, I wouldn't know right off the top without having like a tester or if it says a this is a pretty um it's a Fenton. That's some kind of sign. Um, oh. IG? Well, I don't want it because it's nice, but it's missing like a top. And it's like, does that count as glowing? <laughs> I had a dream that like I went to a store and everything was glowing. Like I had my light out and everything was glowing and I was like, wow, wow, I was like freaking out. I don't know what that is. I think hold something and a little hook. What's this back here? Small little angel. This is like a really interesting stein. Yeah, animal on it. I don't want it, but it's cool, it's different. Oh, this one. I have milk glass like this. It's just too much for that $6.99. I've thrifted it way cheaper than that. This is made by someone. It's got a big chip. And this guy is cute. Oh. <laughs> He's in a bowl. Hmm. I have a lot of old stuff, just um, this stuff that I'm picking up. I don't think it's valuable. I'm just checking. Rachel Ray. 
I like this little bud vase. Made in Japan. Cute. Look at her. Uh oh. She's age nine. Forever. Lucky her. Lucky you. You don't have to like work or anything here. Oh. Okay, let's see. Oh, he's cool. It's all wood. It's five ninety nine. The prices are a little steep here, so I have to be a little, a little picky. Look at her. Two ninety nine. Is she missing a top? She's kind of cool. Too big. Too big to have in my home. Oh wow, it's pretty. Mm, not really something. What am I doing? I got it here. Not really something I'm looking for. I want to look. I'm looking for exceptional things. Jesus and Mother Mary here. She's a planter. She's fantastic. Hmm. Also religious stuff. I haven't really tried to sell. I do have like a Jesus wood carving up for sale, but no budge on that one. Look at this. Observation Tower, Hot Springs, Arkansas. Well, I love Hot Springs. Made in the USA. It's like a bank. $6.99 though. This is Dragon Ware also. With a broken handle. Oh. This is Probably hand painted in Italy. I think. Doesn't say. But he's cute. I don't know. We're totally weird. Three ninety nine. Oh, he's so strange. It's very dirty. Hmm. No, I don't know. Ugh. Oh no no. What about this tree? Handy and I do have Russell, uh, Russell, Ruffle brass faces like that already. This one's kind of cool. This one is a shrimp. No, those are his claws made out like a lobster by Welton. It's cool. Is that like a Mayan calendar? Yeah. Oh. That's really neat. I don't know if it's Mayan calendar. Oh. Oops, my hand was hurting. Sorry. Kind of budged a lot. Not budged. Moved around a lot. Okay, let's see. Do we see anything else here that we quite like? We did good on like silver crust though oh look at this got a chipped flower though bodacious babes um a oh, little french bulldog definitely something of a newer newer production yeah she's so cute Hmm. That's the same shot. Alrighty. Oh, it's a totem poles. They're probably really expensive. No? Handcrafted in Canada for $4.99. Some really cool pieces here. Oh my gosh. Oh, I hope she's not broken anywhere. We should rescue her before she does break. Okay, let's look. I don't know why they're screaming. Okay, so that's not broken. Her hands are fine. I keep surprisingly perfect. And then this must be new. None of the fruits or anything are broken. Her fingers are intact there. Her hat's intact. She's signed. She's $14. But I mean, I think we have to. She's signed by the artist there. I think we have to rescue her before she gets hurt. She will. I mean, this place is outrageous sometimes. 
We have to rescue her. Coming home with us, little lassie. It's gonna be crazy to ship, but I might keep it for myself. Oh, that's pretty. Hmm. Oh, gosh, leave it alone, Sam. Oh, look at this satin elephant. Oh, he's broken, but I love that long trunk. Wait, before we go on that side, let's make sure we didn't skip any. Oh my God, look at his eyes. $2.99. Oh, it's chipped. See what I'm saying? That will happen to her. Uh, is there anyone else we want to rescue? Look how beautiful she is. Look at the detail in her face. Oh, she's so cracked, you guys. Oh, I'm sorry. I can't rescue you. Okay. What are these little chickies? Oh, they're really cute. They just don't care that we are just trying to shop in peace, you know? I think this is um, crystalline. Yeah. We're going to get this. I believe it is crystalline. And if it is, Jocelyn would be proud. Crazy lamp lady. She's amazing with that. Oh, I love her style. She's so cool. At some point, I'm going to grab Adam and we're going to go up there and check out her booth. Oh my gosh, look at He's fantastic. Wow, is it a horse? He looks fantastic at first, but then when it gets worse as you turn it. He's control bubble. I have that one. He's really neat. Really neat. That girl's coming home with us no matter how much she costs. I don't know if you guys are new here let me just repeat something these arranged flowers here always make sure you look underneath them because they might just be hager vases and those can be pretty valuable you know people make their own arrangements all the time so let's go look up here exciting there's some stuff this is actually pretty slow uh, it's usually really packed here this is nice. I wish it was not made in China. I wish it was like a Royal Copenhagen um, crackle dish because that would be worth some money, honey. I think she's a fairy. Oh, <laughs> she's like bl silver blue. It's like two ninety nine. I mean, she's resin, but oh, she's broken. Of course she is, because she wouldn't be here. So. If she wasn't. Oh, look at this fantastic bird. Wow. It's fantastic. It's all broken, though. Wow. I don't want to fix it. I don't want no projects. <coughs> I don't want any projects. This is new. Nice little bud vases don't do nothing in my stores. I have them. I thrifted them very early on and now I'm stuck with them. Oh, we'll just go ahead and pick up some more. Oh, I can't do it for $7. It's not worth $7 at thrift stores and I already have one. So, I mean, that's how much you would actually probably sell it for. So this is more like a resale store. <laughs> Look at Jesus over here. Oh gosh, he's heavy. Jesus, come at me. Oh. I love his pink garb. Marlene. It's cool. Too, too much though to put in my home. Does he have a glass bag? <laughs> I thought that was like a Fenton dinosaur or something. <laughs> oh, what's going on here? Y'all, come on now. See, Jesus is right here. Gosh, let's just leave them alone. Obviously, they need to be alone. This is a cool flower thingy. Hand blown. I just wish that there was color. There's luster, though. There's some luster. I don't know if you could see it down there, but that might just be reflecting, actually, off the 
pink tops that are actually really nice. Look at this one. It's like a velvet. Anyway, I'll leave that. This might be Aura for this. Looks like it. Yeah, it is. Wait a minute. Yeah, this is Aura for. It's all scratched up though. Too bad. Maybe someone will see the worth in that amongst all the other clear items. I did. I noticed it by the pinched bottom. These look like they're hand painted in Italy. It's just one though. No, that actually might uh, not be. It might be Echo in Mexico. Oh, look at this like, beehive picture here. I always love these. I have one for myself. I want color, like pops of color. This is, I'm get, I'm like getting sleepy while thrifting. Uh-oh, uh -oh, we have encountered the children again. Anyways, these are pigs that can fly. Terracotta piggies. Um, just like look through all the stuff, you know, when you're thrifting. Oh my. These are cool. To relax in different colors. But I don't know. Maybe did they paint it or did it come that way? I'm not sure. Very interesting. Oh, oh my gosh, you guys. Look at the platter underneath it. Let me get that out real quick. Isn't that so pretty? It's all banged up. It is really pretty. Hmm, who makes it? I'll have to look that up. So if I ever find it again, we'll keep that. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, there's a bunch of wooden stuff up here. Oh, how are we gonna look through all this now? Let's see. Just briefly. Just briefly. Uh, we'll turn slowly. This looks like a nice, healthy. Uh, yeah, it's all chipped up. <sighs> my head hurts. It hurts. Look at these. <laughs> oh my god. Those are interesting bookends. They are old. <laughs> I'm not interested in them. I am interested in boards like this for like staging my items like use them stagey items looking for any like atomic designs vintage i'm doing that thing where i look to the right and you guys look to the left here's some marigold 4.99 wow look at these this is laser cut Laser engraved. I do like personally like that. Does it sell? Well, that's a different story. Wonder if this is the Crescent. Oh no, but it's a Mill Henry. But I had a picture that I sold, but it took about a year to sell that. So, but that is a pretty good brand, especially for your own self, like in your home. Oops, I'm running into a hanger or something. Ugh, don't you hate that? <laughs> oh, those are some random beads. I don't like picking up random beads because I never know where they've been. Oh, look, this is like an Art Nouveau kind of potpourri dish. That's neat. I wonder who makes that. Hmm. The clear thing, though, you know? Wow, look at this. What in the world? What is that? It's really chipped, but it's weird. Maybe some designer. Oh, let's not let's not forget to look. Oh wow, this might be new. Yeah, home goods. It looks good from afar. 
You know, I worry about like the future when people want to thrift. It's just going to be junk, which is why we're thrifting now. Is this Goofus glass? Yeah. Well, like, it's worn pretty bad. Do something in here. It's kind of Art Deco y. Hollywood Frame Palace in Hollywood, Florida. So cool. It's kind of 80s. Hogwarts. Hogwarts. Harry Potter is still so relevant, y'all. It's amazing. What an amazing franchise. Oh, Garth Brooks. And in front of Garth Brooks is this amazing embroidery box. It's not amazing. It's old. Hmm. I mean, it's old. It's worn. If it was old and in good condition, I would have picked it up. I kind of like how this looks like the top of like a castle tower. It's really badly chipped right there, though, like from the outside. I don't do chipped stuff. I mean, you'd have to be so valuable for me to pick you up chipped. I mean, so valuable. I wonder if this glows. Let's check it out. What do you guys think? I don't think so. yellow glass vintage yellow glass so i look for the glowies it's not glowing these are kind of cool they're like skull shot glasses for 99 cents oh you know what these are yes yes now i have a set of four these are cool candles it's like a whole set shoes hats everything Hmm. Also, I'm sure you already know though. Buy your uh, wrapping paper at um, thrift stores, also. They're getting really expensive. Let's go on the other side. Wow, I found this like brass um, frame, but it's missing the backing. You don't know how old it is. Three ninety nine. Doesn't feel very old. Looks old. I don't know. I would want the whole package. Is that Arthur Court. No, that's a cool platter because it's got calories on it. And then. Does that say Arsenal? This is a cool life is good mug. It's kind of plain. <laughs> Tag's not a bad brand. <laughs> Just not gonna sell for me though. Your one and a melon. Oh gosh. Sheffield Home. Sell that brand at Home Goods. Wow, look at this basket. Is that worthy? Is it broken? No. I don't know about baskets. Like, I don't, I don't know. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and go back, and I'm gonna look for more stuff. And if I, if I don't find anything, I won't say anything. We'll just go back to the car. If I find something, then I'll let you know. Well, I really hope you guys enjoyed that video. Lots of nice, cool things there. I'm not sure when I'll be back there because that's the second time I go there and there's loud screaming, uncontrollable kids. So I'm going to go ahead and pop some Tylenol. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, share, comment, subscribe if you haven't. Most of my videos do not have screaming children in it or me being annoyed. So I really apologize if that annoyed you as well. I apologize. Just go ahead and mute the video and watch it if you need to. But I will always warn you when there are screaming children that just 
it just comes with the territory with thrifting sometimes. Thank you guys so much. Please uh, let me know if there's anything that you want that I thrifted at jollyflips at AOL.com and I will send you price, PayPal, all that. Thanks guys. Take care. Bye.